Hey guys and welcome back to the spawn of Landstriders Terra Firma Punk server brought to you thanks to the generosity of aim to game servers sponsoring this particular server. They're amazing. Check out the links down below if you are looking for some nice standard Minecraft servers or even if you want to run modded. Even as crazy mods as this, these guys can handle it. But I'm off at the spawn at the moment, and that, of course, will lead you guys to think that I have died. Maybe even this death marker in front of me will show you that. Uh, now, you guys will think this is because of the way last episode ended, but I can tell you that is not the case. I actually got rescued from that, and we went off as a whole group on the server to go do some uh, wonderful activities. But first, of course, we had to go up and round all the troops up. Make a I quite like it. It's actually better than the boats. It, it's a lot smoother than the boats. <laughs> right click. I got Where was it? Was this uh, yeah. advanced track? Yeah. He jumped off. Jump, doc, doc fell out. Crush him. He jumped off. <laughs> I can't do this. I keep falling through. Um, but yeah, that's the main thing I need to oh, play for. It's just all those high, all those uh, advanced rails that I, or those high speed rails that I want to make. It don't shift. There we go. Oh, Infernal's not on yet. I'm just kind of grabbing people and flying around. Oh, okay. Well, then if Infernal isn't on, I'll wait. Um, Quite no, nice getting a nice little base to tour enough, for everyone. Uh, minute. Be yeah. careful, there's a big hill. <laughs> It's quite the quite the different experience for me. Usually, when I'm fly, flying around in Archimedes, I'm the one doing the piloting. <laughs> yeah, it's nice just to sit back, relax, let other people do it. You know. Yeah, to enjoy the view, you know, get a take in the sights rather than having to pay attention to the mountain in front of us. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, we need more balloons. It's 65%, by the way, infernal of balloons. Yeah, to... I, I had a bit of issues prior to making the carpenter last night and stuff. Um, I had to go get my key back from that zone we were at the other day. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, yeah, no. 45 minutes of uh, messing around. I've pretty much given up on my gear. Ah, uh, such a glorious circle of wood on the floor over there. One day it will be a good base. One day it will be a good base. <laughs> one day. One day. That's no, that's no biggie. It's not It's not like a big deal. They're there. You ain't out there looking to see what they look like? One of these or one of these. Hey, it's infernal. Oh, there's no way to get lapis. Uh, not in Josh yet. With it off my end. I don't think I have any lapis. Nope. So I have to do go with this recipe here. Alright. The majesty of those trunks, uh, chunks trying to load. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, I think he's inside the vault. He is. Don't come out. I'm killing a druid. Set it down on top of the right. vault then, surely. <laughs> no, I'm up on top of the no. cellar. <laughs> I remember that because last night... Right. <laughs> Honestly, I'd suggest yeah, in, the, in the bay. You, you really should park in the water in the bay, yeah. You guys are we are over water? close your trap door when you're done with it. Thank you. I might just bail now and have a dive. <laughs> we parachutes. Woo! Oh, parachutes. Where'd they come from? <laughs> yeah, come let me out now. Will do. Where are you? Oh, at? you're in the charcoal pit. Sorry, don't know. It's a beautiful setup right now, watching the uh, the grand ship come down in front of the castle we're going to invade. That's amazing. So is there any way of applying a different skin to the uh, balloon blocks? Uh, yeah, you can change your texture pack. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, I thought... I was... <laughs> <laughs> Just wondering whether we could chisel it or something like that, make a, a, a nice little dirigible shape. Um, there's, For future, there's obviously. There's a... Uh... There's a mod, or there's a texture pack specifically for, or there's a couple texture packs actually specifically for Archimedes ships that change the balloon into all kinds of different, like, different tech thing, tech themes. So oh, you can, nice. like, actually build, like, so when you put things together, you can make it more look like actual planes and stuff like that, or vehicles, space vehicles and stuff. I just want to build, like, a Hindenburg replica. Maybe, maybe without the incident uh, at the end. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's no um, helium in there, is it? <laughs> no, but I'm pretty sure it'd burn well. <laughs> hydrogen, <laughs> probably. Hydrogen. Yeah, no hydrogen. Problem. Yeah, straight up. Oh, yeah, Aliens, what they use now? Well, uh, I mean, technically, ago. technically, hydrogen wasn't the problem. It was the uh, poor management of stray sparks. I'm gonna start climbing all your stuff. 
Ouch. Why, thank you, Infernal. Once again, you have been my personal saviour on this server. Wow, look at the number of hearts here. That is so good. So, obviously, we're all meeting up on the airship and had a great time. But once wandering around... Uh, Landstrider's base over yonder, the conversation soon turned to the equipment for the upcoming raid on the castle. I've got a mace on me. I got a knockback mace on me. It's only a copper, but... I've got yeah, a mace, I'm... a sword, and a warhammer for backup. I'm just running around with a copper sword. <laughs> Smith, uh, smithed freshly this morning. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, I was meaning to give you one of these. I'll, uh, I'll be fine with this. Oh no, there's uh, I hold up like six swords. <laughs> oh well, if you got spare going, then yeah, well, be rude, yeah, to, rude to refuse. Right. <laughs> oh okay, so it looks like I've already disconnected. I gotta go back over there. Lance anyways, just wandered past the place on stream where it looks like I'm standing on my screen. Yeah, you're you're not on the list. Loads yeah, my my game still hasn't decided to tell me that I'm gone from the server yet. Yeah, this is looking to be fun event here, guys. Everybody's getting disconnected over here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Funnily enough, I'm doing all right with my connection. Yes, I can use gates yeah. uh, and redstone controls. Wait for, for me, the Dragon. This is what I'm thinking about oh, doing. They're a road trip. I'm coming. But my, my game right, will I'm catch up and tell me. I'm going to head back to our place and pick up the rest of my stuff and grab everybody else. Sounds I'm like a plan. Back. Because we're doing this castle over here, right? So I've been led to believe. Yeah. It's this one here, the one that's up to your left. Yeah. So what we need to do when we uh, conquer it is put massive banners on the front of it with Landstrider symbols all over it, because he can see it from his base. That's why not? Idea. Why not dragon symbols? Well, we'll carve a dragon oh, head into the like the tower of it, right? Okay. Can I put a TARDIS on it? Always put a TARDIS on it, mate. How is that even a question? <laughs> I don't know. I don't want any weeping angels getting to my TARDIS. I mean, who wants weeping angels on the server, anyways? Me. Uh, yeah, it Anybody doesn't sound like a good time, mod. does it? There, there you go, Mister One Wolf. It has been requested. The weeping angel mod. <laughs> oh, man. I like that. I say I want weeping angels. <laughs> well, you gotta admit that would be a pretty sweet mod. <laughs> yeah. Oh, could you imagine? I, could I you think it'd be over quite going shortly. Down into the dungeon with weeping angels all over one of those levels. Oh my god! <laughs> that would be so creepy and scary. That would be fun. Don't, you'd have you'd have like YouTubers screaming like little girls. <laughs> oh, because they don't already. <laughs> <laughs> I would personally prefer the weeping angels over the um those liches. Those things just cause mayhem. I guess. Oh could my! Do. All I can see is names everywhere coming in slowly. Uh, Twitchy. I don't know, know where my went. My water skin went. Ah, uh, sorry. I've got it here, dragon. Uh, hop down here quick, okay. please. Here. There's your fresh sword right behind you. Thank you. Dragon. The water sack. How do you enchant stuff? Uh, that's from Magic. the dungeon. <laughs> What? It's from the dungeon. I told you I had to go down and clean it out last night. You get a full copper sword? Yeah, with enchantments. Yep. You get a bunch of different things out of there. Okay, fine. I'm carrying a warhammer enchanted right now. I did have a halibut. Problem is, he sort of died. <laughs> that is an impressive wall of tools and weapons you've got here, guys. Thank you. <laughs> dungeon loot. Dungeon loot and me going insane while building. What have you got down here? I'm being nosy around your base. That's alright. Is it dragon? It's That's just a, a nice random space. door. Thank you. Yeah, this is storage. It's, it's gonna get a little bit of a makeup yet, makeover yet, yeah. because every once in a while we get mobs down here. So I actually want to put a fence across here to where you, if you come down here, they're either in here or they're over there, not running back and forth. Yeah, oh, yeah. Twitchy, here you go. Go in the iron door. <laughs> is this going to kill me? <laughs> nah, you'll be yeah. fine. Oh, is that's this your charcoal, charcoal pit? pit? Wow. <laughs> Man, that's that's a size. How did you... Oh, I wouldn't even want to fill that. Like, well done. <laughs> I did it yesterday. It took me literally... Oh, about six hours all up. 
Yeah, I can well believe it. I had to wait for trees to regrow. We're just gonna listen to these guys. I'm gonna program while I wait for them to come back. I'm pretty much ready. I think. Okay, we're just about leaving. It'll float bounce. on the water. Yeah. Yeah, water's okay. fine. Yeah, being in the water's fine. Infernal's still floating there. Uh, right now I'm down near the back end of the inn. Uh, I actually need to make sandwiches real quick. This little it's, zombie uh, statue you've got in the fish inn properly made me think there was a zombie in here when I walked in. <laughs> <laughs> I fully jumped, turned around to run <laughs> out. That's <laughs> the ballet. Oh, it was amazing. No, to... <laughs> Mr. Toast has a for you there. So this bolt action flintlock <laughs> and the musket cut. Oh. Bolt action flintlock and the musket cut. I'll be back in a moment. Oh, cartridge, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The, You're yeah. healed, Doc. Why do you need the spring top Thank you. strings? I was, of course, eternally grateful to everyone who helped me out. And, of course, getting around and seeing everybody's base also really helped me just to kind of get an idea of where I should be heading here. I know I'm going for a different thing, obviously my tower, but, like, what you put inside the base is also just as important. Now, I believe it's straw on the bottom here. It's been, a, you know, a week or so since I've done this. Um, but, yeah, once all that was done, we did, of course, have to go and have a look at the castle and know exactly what it was we were going to go face. Yeah, this is just a recon mission, guys. Just a recon mission. Just, just keeping an eye out. Bring, bring, bring me around on the other side. Or bring me to the other side here. I saw a spawner box directly under that main tower there. Yeah. Do, do another flyby of the front with me on the, on the other side. So I can blast it with this arrow. There appears to be something at the bottom of all the little towers as well, looking in through the windows. I think there's potentially a spawner in each of those towers. And then there's the, the witch, herself, witch, witch herself, so potentially I think we might have five spawners and a witch at most. That sounds like fun. Here we go, guys. Well. Here we go. Okay, you got to get close without touching. Okay, who's got Operation Fight of the Red Snow up. is a go. And we gotta be able to parkour to this. Yeah, you gotta. I thought it was Operation Wanna Build a Snowman. <laughs> well, actually, if you. I thought it was Operation Wanna Melt a Snowman. <laughs> actually, if you plow into the nothing? clouds, is fine, because we can break the clouds afterwards. That sounds like the best idea, actually. Almost like a D Day type landing, plow into it, jump out, run in there, and storm the castle. That's that's it. Well, this, is, this is. You do this pop is... parachutes when you Here jump we go. out. You bet... No, we gotta get up. We gotta get up higher. Much higher. Hey. Whoa, whoa, what is that? Um. Our captain I'm just stuck. bailed. Captain bailed and we're sinking. <laughs> <laughs> Someone quick grab the. Oh, we're good. He's back. Maybe. You told me I can't park the ship there. Yeah, because you. Uh, you gotta go up and above and then come over and come down. Yeah, you wanna Try get aim to land above it on something. the quartz block or something. Yes, you want to land on the box. We got there we go. Guys. Beautiful. There we go. Attack! Okay, mm -hmm. what do we see? What do we see? Lance is leading the way. Let's follow in. Oh, watch. In the minute, oh. let's, uh, go, go, go. Catches up. Oh, I just got blinded. Oh, I'm going to get wrecked. <laughs> Of course, once we got to the front door, we then did have a protracted sort of standoff, like I'm kind of doing here, where we all knew that the guys inside us could probably kill us pretty quickly, but we were still just testing the strength of what was going on. I took out one spawner. Oh, we didn't why didn't I bring a pickaxe? We didn't bring in our potions, guys. Oh, this is fun. Oh, yeah, smack him in. Oh, I'm stuck. Yeah, break any spawners you can find. Yes, absolutely break I'm spawners. Stuck. Quit Game finally yeah. caught up, and I'm in the water. That's probably a safe place for you. I'm nerding up. Got corner, the spawner in the front right corner next to the ship. So he's got to go break the spawner in the main tower back there. I'm on it. Good man, good man. I if would I can see, I'm stuck again. Ah. Oh, I don't have a pick. Uh, oh, dude, they they like they reflect damage onto you even when you're using them. Ah, oh, what? That one poisons at us again. 
No, that's Oh, no, me. that's you. That's you. That's you. That's good. So oh, splash by regen's hand. like ah. <laughs> Splashing us with regen. Good. Ah. No, Twitchy. Two hits. Well, not, Two hits. <laughs> I'm out. I'm out. I'm going to die. So, obviously, that was by no means the ideal outcome of that first little foray into the castle. But thankfully, spawn is a merely four kilometers away so all they all that had to happen was people had to wait for the 15 minutes for me to swim back before we could go on and have another crack at trying to get on in there so did the spawners get broken left and right some of them yeah no. yes the, the, the front two ones front ones did, did. the back no, front one's not one yet okay i'm poisoned we got a, uh, i'm still we have 30 okay 49 health Twitchy, get out of there, you got no armor. Oh no, I'm just walking around the outside, there's uh he's not gonna hit me. Yeah, run, I'm dragon, gonna run. take my way through there. I can't get I couldn't get back to that back spawner, I got stuck in the block or something. Yeah, right. there's carbon over that's so what... not loading in properly. Alright, I'm in the back area, I'm Ah oh, no. start digging through. <laughs> oh then we're dark. No duck, no There's something like got that. Got the back spawner. Oh the big guy. Just teleport me back. Working on it, working on it, give me time. Ah. Making a dash for the back. That guy Twitchy. kinda hurt. Uh the where your grave is up the back, that spawner yes. is gone. But the dry, uh looks like the giants have pinged on to me. Yeah, I, I see the giant. I'm gonna try and make my way around and maybe get out through the wall. Yeah, um the back ah. end is open, so you can That's come around nice. the back. Grab right, my stuff. But <laughs> I don't know how well, safe you can't it run here. No, it doesn't look safe. I might, I might wait for him to. Give me to, a sec. Uh, I've got some fitted frosted blocks. I'll try and uh, double gang him over. Yeah, no, that'd be great. Well, I'll there's definitely to. ways to get back up here now. <laughs> I gotta literally run back and forth, back and forth, just to try and get this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no, keep it safe, man. Keep it safe. Don't, uh, don't take too many risks. Right, I think they've aggroed. Alright, I've got a little bit of a wall in front of your grave. Okay, yeah, I'm the, grabbing the, the grave now. Of, the amount of reflected Spawn. poison and stuff like that is a little... Uh, did you grab a chest uh, plate? Oh. Maybe we need to turn that off uh, and yes. attack this place. <laughs> and I've got a bowl and... Oh, well, no, I wanted to see... The, this is, you know... We need to see what the... Ba this isn't and too cartridges. bad. Brilliant. Go, it's mate. doable. Brilliant, it's thank you very not, much. You can't do All it good. head on. We've just got a couple more of these guys to take care of. They can't actually come out the front door, so. Yeah, I noticed that, that they can't come out that front door. Hey, Twitchy, this way. We're in. I see. Yeah, yeah let's do it, man. Chess. Oh, <laughs> just waiting for that to blow up on us. Nothing. The really. uh, there's a water sack. Grab it, Twitchy. You there's can a water sack. Oh, yeah. brilliant. Thank you. Got any poison? Going up. Have we got anything in here? Yeah, yeah I got a regen. Yep. Give me a second. I'm down to 170 Sweet. health. Why do all those chests have the same stuff in them? <laughs> well, that's weird. It's glitch. You're glitched. Oh, yeah. he, okay. I'm glitched too. Oi. Okay, no spawner on the second room, but I would recommend getting up as fast as possible. All right, let's do it. Let's go hit. The, if you go hit the spawner, I'll just run distractions. Everyone's. Uh, Everybody's still trying to take up. out these giants in the front. Too much poison. There's man. an unstable ice core spawner. Do you want to broken? Break well, it. You get break out it. Get down. Oh, I've fallen. The hell? What are you up to up there? There's blocks everywhere. The poison is what's hurting us. The 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 reflection. Yeah, you can't. I can't do anything to that guy. Yeah, it's it's just freaking impossible. It's down. Good His work. health Good is work. like amazingly high. <laughs> These ladders, so man. The yeah, moment you look off of the line, it's the fact that every time you hit him, you're poisoned, and or you're or you're caught on fire. Every time you hit, it's the reflection Snow of the damage that's killing. Uh, get down for now. That's the that's problem. Okay. Ah, oh, I was dropping. What? <laughs> you guys activated the smoke queen already. Yeah. Uh, by accident. Yeah, by accident. We were just climbing. Yeah, this is. This is gonna be bad. Very bad. 
So of course all my problems on the assault led from a horrific combination of problems from within myself. One is the insistence that I go and see what is going on. You know, as a YouTuber I'm kind of filled with that want to go and get everything on camera. But of course the second thing is I only have peasants equipment. So uh, going and seeing everything that was important with no equipment kind of led to my death. That and the one shot from the Queen. Wow, one shot. I I, ha I have to abandon to to go freaking stand in a in a thing. Yeah. Because there's no way I can do anything. You know. For the next, I mean, if I was to let myself regen naturally, I mean, it would literally, would literally walk away for a half an hour and come back and, and maybe be a full hour. Yeah, way too slow. These blocks are kind of cool looking though. Yeah. yeah. And then even if I did have the regen potion, they have almost no effect. Yeah, yeah, I noticed that when uh, Doc hit me with the regen potion, it was it nothing. Me. I mean, I got like 30 health. Yeah, that was I, I was under regen, regen when I got killed just then. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know, maybe if we had like every buff available in the game, then maybe it would be a toe-to-toe a -to -toe battle. But literally be everything. Toe -to -toe. We haven't even fought the, the queen yet. Yeah. And she's worse than the giants. You go up there with 2,000 health, and you hit one the mob one time, and then you're down 1,000 health. That's not fun. Yeah, yeah I'm no, up. That's what I was getting. I'm down to uh, 499, but I was at 400 from 12. Okay. Uh, just, just so you guys know, I changed the configuration on the instant health. The multiplier was set to 15. I changed it back to the default of 50. Let's see how much this heals me. Hardly anything. Still, still, that only gave me like 500 hit points. Not even that. Not I even that. You, oh wait. So are, are we ready to kill the witch here? Or are we gonna continue? Are we gonna do I that? Laid out a marker of light. I don't know where everyone is uh, coming up. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> I'm gonna hang back this turn. I just want to see what kind of damage it does. If it kills me relatively quick, then I guess. Then we're boned. What's she doing? I just want to. I want to. I want to see if hitting her deals damage to me. <laughs> no. Oh man, my uh, graves all the way Nothing's up. What's happening? Isn't it? Actually, I already recovered your stuff. Oh, even better. Oh, hello. Where's one of those things come from? I'm just gonna hide. Just gonna hide down here. Dangerous stuff all around. <laughs> so she's up there. Yeah. Cool. I don't suppose someone could take out this uh, little ice crystal. Oh, yeah, the ice crystals are ri ridiculously easy to destroy. So. You play Twitch. <sighs> Ouch. I say you clear Ouch. and then you die. <laughs> oh, that is so good, man. That is so good. That tickled. How hard is she hitting, guys? I don't know. Hasn't hit me. I don't know. She just... I wasn't even that bad on health and just doing fine. And then all of a sudden I was dead. So evidently she one-shot me or something. <laughs> yeah, one-shot. <laughs> Yeah, that's been my castle experience so far. <laughs> I went to go down the ladder and I see knocked up like, ah, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Too late. Yeah, she bounced me up and out. Or up into the room with her. Thank Chromie, I got one spare suit of armor. I've got a spare suit on my character, but I've got one spare at the base. Some dodgy armor, but it works. Hello, give me a pile of water. I didn't fall that far. Hey, I think this has been kind of interesting, except for the yeah. giants part. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely been interesting. Interesting is the one I would go with. <laughs> so, did we get the Snow Queen down yet? Nope. Nope. <laughs> All I see are death messages. And I hate to say it, Twitchy, but your stuff's now your stuff I recovered is now in my gravestone at the top of the tower. <laughs> <laughs> that that's all right. I'm sure I'll be able to like claw it all back somehow. Yeah. It, it was just food, water, and stuff people had given me anyway. Uh, 
I, I appreciate the gifts, but... Oh, it's alright, Twitchy, <laughs> okay. man. We had it there. I the, uh... told Dragon you were joining us, and he's going, no. Nah. I've even put it forward to him, like, I'm gonna get him armoured first. There's enough down in the dungeon, he's going, yeah, for sure. Get the guy's armoured up. Considering what we went through last night, Land, and this, I think, uh... The poison needs to be disabled. Or, not so intense. Cause that was, every time you hit him, you poison, and you poison for two minutes? No. Yeah, I think it might be a shame to completely disable the, it. The ones, the ones on no, I think it needs to be completely. The ones on uh, the bottom of the dungeon, they throw these potions at you, and yeah, it's like a two-minute poison, and it's and then it's almost like every other mob does it. We could have, we there's cheaty ways we could have done that. I mean, we could have snuck up on the spawners and you know dug underneath them and destroyed them and things like that. But what what the heck? That's no fun. That is just no fun. I did the loop around the tech of spawn. I mean, yeah. that, yeah, I mean, technically we ended up doing that anyway, but, um, sort of. That's but only two tries. That's something I like to do, like, after I've defeated it the proper way, you know? Yeah. I, I mean, I like to go, I, I like to know that at least the proper way to, to do, to go through a dungeon is completable. To do a full on assault. And, and then I, and then I it. start figuring out the exploity ways to take it down. Yeah, faceless. That's pretty much the uh, sum up of the evening. There, Operation Red Snow was a major failure. I'm gonna tone it down. Yeah, yeah, oh, no, I'm, I'm on definitely that. on board. That was just OP as all Toledo. Man. Yeah, Those tone, hits tone him down a little bit. I mean, I would like try making it like vanilla easy, but no, I know. Oh yeah, I, I wouldn't want, want it turned into yeah, fluff. We don't, but, yeah, we don't want that. I mean, but you know, ultimately, it'd be nice if a per a, a fully geared well-prepared person could take that on obviously one person going up there with the best armor and everything else would have got their face sanded to him <laughs> yeah like nerfing the power range down a little bit just to make it without using fair. without using cheaty things like yeah like okay the lowest parts of the dungeon you do need to have red or blue steel armor like top tier armor to be able to survive it but you can go down the first two or three levels in bronze like bronze armor and stuff too and still copper beaten but not enough to be annihilated in one hit i say the first level and a half in bronze and then after that you're gonna the second level is gonna be iron steel yeah i agree with that so all in all despite the slightly salty aftertaste we're all left with about the snow queen i quite enjoyed that assault on the castle there i got to hang out with all my new friends and see exactly how far behind the pace i am here's a spoiler a lot but with all my friends that are now playing on the server here i think we should be able to get over that so with that, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. I will see you all next time when we're going to get back on trying to do all the quests and become self-sufficient. We've got a nice little farm over there and the house definitely needs some work. But yes, I will see you next time when we're going to do all of that.